Welcome everybody to another awesome live stream by the Gamers Brew. As always, I'm your host with the most, Brandon of the Gamers Brew. Today guys, we are going further than beyond as we go ahead and check out to see what Team Flare is doing here. Searching through these weird rock formations. Let's roll that intro as we get started. <laughs> Yeah, these rock formations over here. I'm not sure what Team Flare is doing here, so we're just kind of going to go around and see if there's any items we can grab. How's everybody doing today? Hey, Lux. Hey, Zack. Hey, Dragon. Aura the Q. Welcome. Ah, it's a pretty town. We can't get through till Zoroa, how's it going? Hear this, Pipsqueak. Team Flare is going to use stones on Route 10 and a fantastic treasure to make every one of our team happy. In this world, the ones who have power are the ones who win. Brew, that was someone from Team Flare. Yup. He was here, but he isn't anymore, is he? The only thing past the air is a dead end. There's something weird about Team Flare. I mean, I can see the door. Well, I mean, think about it. Team Rocket was kind of a mafia. They used Pokemon to increase, like, revenue. I mean, you're not wrong. Team Flare does have interesting outfits. back there real quick. Ooh, a timer ball. That might come in handy down the road. So how's everybody's day going today? I think we can get another O power while we're here. Downcast Ribbon. Weird. Oh, it's a Pokemon Ribbon, like, like for completing stuff. I forgot that those were a thing. Yeah, we're already on the next route already, Zach. Yeah, that's what it is. So I knew it was something. Adds a little spice to life. There you go, Zach. You got a downcast ribbon. Apparently, you're feeling a little depressed. Lucario, what are you doing? 
Hey, you're that trainer from Route 5. Not exactly sure what you... Uh, but I think Lucario is saying it wants to battle you. Would you want to battle us? I have two Lucarios. Do you know which one is taking a shine to you? Uh-oh. I guess the Lucarios used Transform? Two Luc... That's obviously a Lucario. It's a fluffier Lucario that's on all fours. Hey, guess what? Force Palm! Ooh. Oh, you've got to be kidding me! We just got him back! How is that fair? We just got him back! We just got him back! Oh guys, that's death six. Again. We had just got him back. He used two workups and then used takedown. Uh, hey, Red. We literally just got back to um, Fishcario, and then two workups and a uh, takedown takes him out in one full hit. He was full health and everything. Ugh. needs to be a thing. We need a fighting type. Yeah. That being said, jo Jody's going hams to the wall for, like, I honestly thought Jody was going to be a throwaway Pokemon as a Sunflora, but come on, that's, she's, she's doing work. Now I get it. I see why Lucario likes you so much. Do you remember? I'm the gym leader of, um, Shalaro City. Once you get past the caves just beyond here, you'll be there. So just stop by and say hello. I mean, that squawk would have been nice. He's another fighting type. We need a fighting type. I mean, Star Raptor's still a long ways away from learning close combat. Shalor. See, I thought it would be the SHL Shalor. But Shalor, that sounds better. Uh, back to six. I'm thinking we're gonna put the Reggie Rock back in. He's got so much HP. For only being level 20. I mean, that's really what this is coming down to now. Is just an HP game. Yeah, we're bringing back out the Reggie. Alright. Hang on a second. I need to find a better image of Reggie Rock.
I'm just... I'm just so upset that we lost him again. I mean... That hurts. That hurts. <laughs> More to live his life as a Reggie Rock. Uh, nah, man. Didn't you know? He's Reggie Gigas. He is, he is the biggest of the Reggies. Oh, there's a slide area. Let's see what our Pokemon's gonna be, guys. Come on. Give us something good. Mindfoon? There we go. There's a fighting type. Anybody want to be mine, Foon? Oh no! Why critical hit? Oh! Come on! I liked that one too. It evolved into something fun. Why? Why? You're so damn powerful. Why do you have so much, like, bulk to you? We need to- we need to switch him around. I, th I think at this point, I think, Zach, you, you've just gotten so overpowered. You're almost level 30 now. We need to move you to the back, and we need to move someone up front. That critical was just unlucky. He would have been fine had it not been a critical. Hey, Domestic Fish. How's it going, buddy? Uh, not only did we lose you, Domestic Fish, but we just lost our chance to catch our Pokemon in this route. How am I doing? I'm feeling better today. I came down with either the flu or food poisoning yesterday. I'm not sure which, but I couldn't keep anything down. Yeah. Herdier, same level as you. Um, I switched in. He used power up. Used it again. Used power up. Then you were still at full health at this point. And then used takedown and just wrecked you all your HP at once. Mark, how you doing? Hmm. 
I'm hoping it was only food poisoning, because, I mean, where my wife works, the flu goes around quite rampantly because she works in a doctor's office. So, I mean, I could have got it from just, you know, just something sticking to her clothes or something. Hollow receiver. Hey, look, it's the professor. Professor here? Hello there! Looks like you've almost made it to... Shaloa City. That's fantastic! It looks like your journey with your Pokemon around the Kalos region is going swimmingly. I wanted to tell you uh, um, about a person in Shalor who knows a great deal about Mega Evolution. People call him the Mega Evolution Guru. I told everyone about him, so if you have a second, you should give him a visit. Oof. I care about the TM though. Hang on, I think this is, is this that is this this isn't charge stone. Charge stone is in black and white too. Which cave is this? Yeah, I need to move Zach down a bit. Let's move Zach to a different spot because he's he's sitting pretty good. You're really strong right now, Zach, so let's let's switch you with Cam. Cam's 24, not as weak as Lycanroc, so we can switch into Lycanroc in type matches. Oh, I loved Black and White. I uh, did a, actually a Soul Link with another YouTuber on our channel, uh, Black and White 2. It went really well. We were actually able to finish it. Alright, let's go ahead and switch you guys real quick. Just gotta change the typings. I can't remember what Cam's typing is. I know I just saw it's Dark Dragon, yeah. Drop yours in there, Zach. Cause Zach is just too powerful. I mean, I liked Diamond and Pearl just because of the extra stuff you could do with the secondary screen. Uh, it's gonna be a double battle. Yeah, Cam and Joey should be able to take on a double battle. So, Psychic and Fighting. Brains and Brawn, Frank and Sly. Aw, oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Really, a Vanillish? Hoping we don't lose anybody in the switch. Oh no, I just realized 
bad choice. Oh good, you missed. Wait, self-destruct? Well then... It immediately self-destructed. You should be faster. Oh. He immediately self-destructed. Did you notice that? There was, like, not even any hesitation. The coughing just like, nope, gonna blow up today. Yeah, let's get you to no crunch. Crunch is good. Oh, I loved Heart Gold and Soul Silver, though. I've been waiting to do that one because there's a version of it called Perfect um, Gold and Perfect uh, Silver. That is heart gold and soul silver, but it is not, I wouldn't say the definitive, but it, it fixes the few problems that heart gold and soul silver had. They weren't many problems, mind you, but there were a few. Welcome back. Welcome back, Jess. I would have thought he would have gotten more experience out of that. Flygon's a s is a third stage. Second evolution. Come on. I really liked the original Ruby and Sapphire, though, though I really liked Emerald better than that. And I wish, wish, wish they would have done as much with the remakes for Ruby and Sapphire as they did for Heart, Gold, and Soul Silver. I mean, I can't be the only one who feels like they needed to have done more. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, if you overstretch, you'll do just as much damage as not stretching. Ooh, Tyron. Perfect! The little rock dragon. Night Shame, how you doing there, buddy? What's been going on with you? Alright, no rollerblades, no bikes. Wait, what was the name of this place? Reflect Cave? Reflection Cave. Tell you the truth, I'm thinking of never leaving this place. Um, it shouldn't be crackling. It would stink if it is, though. I'm sorry if it is. Let me take a look. If it's my end audio or all 
All right, there. I, f I changed something up just a little bit here. Is it still crackling? Pokemon for the area is a Torterra! Oh my god, guys, we found us our grass type! Oh my god, yes. Okay. Like, I love Jody, but Torterra, ground, grass, that's some solid typing. Besides that, I love Torterra and his big old tree on his back. You wanna be thick, turtle? No worries, Lux, we can get. Well, we are going to do our best to get him. So first off, let's... Oh, wait, he's ground type, which means he can't get paralyzed, even if it's not a normal one. So we're just going to have to run type moves here. Let's go ahead and crunch for the initial hit. Um, as far as I know, there's nobody who's a sponsor right now who's looking to grab a Pokemon. Domestic Fish was here earlier, but I... I mean... I don't think he's still here. Come on. Pull him. So far, it's Withdrawal, Curse, Razor Leaf. I haven't seen anything that's super gonna hurt us right now. I think we got him. Yeah, we did. Alright, Lux. Looks like you're Torterra. Do you want it to be called Luxmos? Lux, what do you want it to be named? Torterra, the continent Pokemon. Ancient people imagined that beneath the ground was a giant Torterra. Luxterra? I mean, you could. Luxera or Luxterra? Alright. Luxera it is. Alright, that's never the enter. This is always the enter. I always forget that. Luxera has been um, transferred to box one. We're gonna go grab him. Maybe. Hang on. I don't know, Jody's pretty up there though. Um, Lux, I'm gonna grab you as soon as um, Lycanroc is at least level 20, cause Jody is level 27, and I'm gonna be honest, I don't feel like we can really sacrifice her just yet, so let's... Wait, what? That's just the, it should be just the thing. It's just the dowsing machine. It's not going to let me use the dowsing machine within the uh, thing. Alright. Lux, you have a good one. Oh! Mew! Mew! Mew, 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 mew!
Dragon's Breath could kill Cam, though. Oh, it didn't, though. So Cam can survive the Dragon's Breath, but he's not going to be able to survive, uh... Alright, so let's go ahead and... Mew is so much faster than Cam is. Dragon James's Pokemon. He's gonna he's gonna have to be the one. Cause he can survive two of those. He can survive a, he can survive two dragon rages in theory. Should probably duck out. Come back in. Ooh, bayonet. It's a Nuzlocke. That's that's why. Just Nuzlocke rules means we can only capture the first Pokemon we encounter in the in the area. Each area has a new encounter chance. out of here though we need to heal <sighs> I don't know like bayonet seems pretty good Torterra Mew Interesting to see what Torterra might have had on it, though. Torterra could have been carrying something. Like I said, I don't want to bench Jody just yet, because Jody's pretty high up there, because Jody's been pulling ball. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at Torterra. Torterra's got Overgrow, Absorb, Curse, Razor Leaf, Withdrawal. Waylord, Waylord was from Gen 3, so of course he's in this one. Anything Gen 6 down can can be found. Legendary, mythical, anything. Even event legendaries are in here. I mean, in theory, we could even run into an Arceus. I'm just saying, we could run into Arceus. It's completely plausible. Yeah, I skid you. You really think we need a Waylord? I don't know, we've got two dragons. Half of our team is weak to, or no. Wow, I didn't even realize this. Cam, Jody, Thordak, and Zack Quack are all weak to ice. Like, ice is going to wreck us. We, we need Nigel to get up there. I'm thinking about throwing him. As soon as Cam gets a bit bigger, I'm thinking about throwing him in the front. I mean, seriously. Huh? 
either that or I really need to turn back on, like, I need to turn on EXP All. I don't know. Do you guys feel like EXP All is worth putting on? Hey, YouTuber. Hey, how's it going? I see myself. I see you. Seeing myself. Seeing you. I love how nobody wants to actually say whether or not we should uh, turn on EXP all. Ooh, Vigor off. He's got the Vigor! I mean, it would get through some of this training. Also, putting in lower level Pokemon... ...would solve the issue, too. Like, Lycanroc would be getting some experience right now. Alright, I think that's what we're gonna do. I think we're actually gonna turn it on. Pineco or Ferrisseed. I love Ferrisseeds. How much slower are you than me? That's going to determine the damage. Oh, good. You're not that much slower than me. No, 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 no. Shiny is red, Zack. Yeah, sure, why not? We'll learn Pedal Dance. This Pedal Dance is 120, two turns. Yeah. Run that over, Bold Seed. Life's going good. Life's going good. Heal you up. <laughs> How am I doing? I'm doing 420. Because <sighs> that's exactly how I'm doing. How'd you know? No, not really. Not really. I'm doing good. Say it's not 420 today. It's also not 420 the time for me yet. Ah, uh, Swallow Lot. Use Encore. Oh wow, Swallow Lot's got a lot of beef. I forgot Swallowot had so much beef to him. Switch its attack and defense. How'd you avoid the attack? So basically, it switched its attack and defense twice, so now it's back to the same attack and defense. I... I fail... I fail to see... I fail to see the logic behind your choice there. Use power switch twice, yes, because that's exactly what needed to be done.
I know, I was feeling that it was gonna transform, but didn't. That's fine. Ah, uh, synchronize. Wait, what? That's not fair. How does it have a lumberry? Hey, Big Teeny. Oh. No worries, domestic. Switching Cam and Nigel real quick. Nigel needs some more battle experience. second here. Getting much better at doing these faster. Yeah, so what you missed was fish died, then in the next route, um, we killed off the Mindfu because of a critical hit. Then we caught, um, Torterra within the cave. And we keep running into Muse. And apparently a Butterfree. Oh no, I'm confused. <laughs> They're all Muse. Ace Trainer. I don't know about, about all that. I just love Pokemon. Oh my god, Ace Trainers. I love Ace Trainers. Ace Trainer Monique! Sends out Magmar. Magmar. We're ready for that mirror match. Right, right heckin' now. Rock Tomb! See guys, Rock Tomb was a great move to throw on him for the mirror match. Or for the mirror type. Or Shadow type. Mirror typing. Yes. 27. Thordak. Grew to level 28. Wants to learn Slash. Yeah, sure why not. Muse the legendary, or is the mythical from the first generation. Play luck, how's it going? Let's 
drop Sandstorm. Oh, Slam is as strong as Strength. Yeah, no, no worries. We got Strength. Wow, Zach. Level 30. About to use War Turtle. I don't know what butter in Spanish is. I'm sorry. I don't know how to how to how to pronounce the Spanish butter. Is that how you say it? Nifty. I hope so too, Victini. But more so, I'm hoping I have the Master Ball to catch you with, if that's the case. If that's the case, just overall. I mean... I've never had to learn the Spanish name of butter, I'll be honest with you. Even in Spanish class, I don't ever remember being taught, hey, this is the butter. Butter. Raise your team defense that does nothing for special defense! Uh oh, we're poisoned. Hopefully we got some berries or something to deal with this. Later, YouTuber. As a fellow Pokemon lover, you're an ace yourself. Now obtained the title of Ace Trainer. Mmm. Though I think at this point, I think I'd be um, an elite trainer. Oh, good. We do have a couple of those. How much paralyzed heals do we have? We got two? Yeah, why not? Welcome back, Jess. Yeah, can't do nothing with that. Guess we have to go downstairs. Of course we use the our healing items right before the healer. Well, at least now we don't have to go too far to heal. A uh, Fletchender. Ooh, Fletchender. I'm sorry, but... Rock Tomb. I just, I feel like I wasted him, Victini. I'm sorry. It's just, I'm like, oh yeah. Paralyzed heal, an antidote. It's not like we're running on a budget in this game. Black belt for them fighting type moves. Let's see here, Pokemon. Only one with Rock Smash is him. Let's go ahead and take out his item. Use slash give. Let's go ahead and power him up with his fighting move. I mean, he's already a rock type, so I mean, here's the muffin. <gasps> I'd love a muffin. Oh my god, it's the Omnistar! I'll praise the Helix.
praise him. You gotta admit, he looks so funky. His mouth. His beautiful plus-shaped mouth. Oh no, I'm not saying that. I'm just saying, he's Lord Helix. <gasps> Finally a good fire-type move, thank you. Let's be honest, we're never gonna use Scratch. I also find it funny that mom's telling me I can't use my, uh, what's it called? The, uh, dowsing rods here. It's like, geez, mom, it's just a cave. It's not like I'm trying to ride my bike in a building or something. Sorry guys, I was just responding to some DMs I got on Discord real quick. you it's gonna be a ferrothorn again yep ferrothorns always hang from ceilings I, would, I never get what's up with that I could have gotten a fair thorn that would have been pretty cool. Oh! Hey, Master Brew! If you use Flash... Wait, if you use the move Flash, not as many Pokemon will turn up. Oh. So Flash is, like, Repel? It kind of depends on Flash. I'm still not very good at battling, so I keep running into trouble. I'm sure... I sure wish I could be as good as you. I mean, thanks for Flash. <gasps> oh, Honedge! Oh, I would have loved you too! I would have loved you, Honedge! Got the escape rope. Everybody's still doing pretty good. We shouldn't have to backtrack just yet to heal. Ah, uh, you're that psychic cat. I like to say escape. 
I don't know why you can't hear me. Everybody else, can you guys hear me? Fire Fang! Ooh, Fire Fang flinch! And burn. We should probably just run Sir Nigel till he's a Charizard. What do you guys think? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. So it's looking like Dragon, um, the, that Dragon move is no longer, well, Zach, you're level 31 now. Yeah. Seems like that Dragon move is no longer, uh, thing. It's no longer one hitting or two hitting, so we might start just focusing on type advantage. <gasps> Aurorus! Ooh, you're worth some pretty experience. You're a, you're a buff fluff bird. Ain't nobody gonna stop you now. He's a brontosaurus. Dragon Slayer. Really? Only 500 for that? That dude was big! It was bulk! Nidoran female. Let's go ahead. Who do we got? Wow, Lycanroc is like the only one that's like super low, but his, his level up is slow. No, 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 I wouldn't have lost him. One hit, one kill. Let's go ahead and heal up Nigel. It's not worth risking him. I know we say risk it for the biscuit, but... I mean, there, there's no point in risking him right now. Oh no! Just, where is my darling gone off to? <laughs> You're challenged by tourist Harutu. Harutu. Ooh. How do you? See, I love these fire mirror matches with Sir Nigel because I'm gonna be honest, that rock throw, or rock tomb, just absolutely wrecking those those mirror type matches. Welcome back, Dini. Out. 
from one rock to another. Come on, just hit him. Oh no! You gotta use explosion. Uh, Jody, I hope you can. I hope you can eat this. I hope you can eat it. Eat it and don't die. Okay, good. He used rollout instead of explosion. I was expecting an explosion. There was no need to run. Yeah, there was no need to run. Jo Jody could have Jody could have eaten through that. Ooh, a hyper potion. Really need to sell off those revives for that extra coin. What do you think, honey? Should we share some of our happiness with this young trainer? Wow. A snake and a butterfly. Rock snake. Harder than hard as rock could be, cause he's Rock Snake! Giga Drain. I saw what you did there. Oh, they're going after Jody. I mean, your your beautifly isn't the like end all be all of all are all beautifies. I mean, if he was, that'd be kind of crazy. Oh, don't crit, don't crit, don't crit, don't crit. Oh, thank God. Wait, what's natural gift? Ah, uh, it's based on berry. No, she doesn't. We defeated the honeymooners! Aww. That's adorable, they're on a honeymoon. In the meantime, though. Jody could use a spritz. Oh, 
What's a good name for Voltorb? Boom goes the dynamite. <laughs> that shall be his name forever, now known as Boom Goes the Dynamite. Now, um... What could you name a Voltorb? Trying to think of that one for you. I mean, Shock Ball, Zex. Not wrong with that. It's not a bad name. Yeah, I'm. Zack, you're who I pull out when I don't want to mess around. No, just go straight, Jody. Don't even risk it. I'm not even thinking of risking that. Hey, Kevin. How did I run into it? I didn't even know it was there. Uh. Run. I'm gonna go ahead and heal up Nigel. I don't wanna risk. We got 14 super potions. I wanna see if I can get back to the healer. Because everybody needs some more. Oh, no, you wouldn't. Oh, he did. Oh, that was a critical hit, too. We're not catching you. Use butt. Ah, uh, my own mirror match played against me. Loss of blow. Uh, sub. Ah. Lost Subrogen, welcome, welcome Blade. Guys, we're getting raided by Ark. Welcome, welcome Raiders. Don't want to lose Sir Nigel here. Almost lost Sir Nigel to the mirror match. 
Mew just used transformation. It was not. It was not pretty. Uh, why did I make it over here? Heal me. How's it going, Subrosion? Bala, welcome. Welcome on that raid. Waiting for the man himself to show up. Doing good, doing good. Von Diva the Rebel, welcome on that raid as well. Believe it or not, Ark's Pokemon is actually still in our team. Uh, Lycanroc is Ark Lycan's Pokemon he uh, chose. Right. Ah! It's me. Oh. Hi, Ark. Guys, if you haven't already, please make sure to check out Ark imp for the raid. You got, he took the time to raid us. You guys can take the time to go check him out. Send him a like, send him a sub. Uh, please hashtag Ark in the chat as well. Yeah, Ark, your boy's still doing pretty good here. Thank you for the sub. Welcome to the brew crew. Welcome to the gamers crew. You know, I'm just I'm gonna I'm just gonna go up. We're just gonna go up. I was gonna go down to see what magical stuff is, but I'm kind of worried now. <laughs> is in the horde. Oh. Ah, oh. uh, the Pokemon that we caught for the area arc was, um... God, what was he? He was... Um, Torterra, the, uh, Turtwig's final evolution, the grass starter from, uh, fourth gen. That's who we- I know. What's worse is the second Pokemon we ran into was a Mew. After Torterra, it was Mew. Hey, Kaden. I believe Deoxys was in the horde. I mean, we could try to horde spam for a shiny. And maybe get lucky. But I mean, since they're all different, the chance that it's going to be Deoxys if it is the shiny, I mean, probably low. the next one that I roll down, okay. Yeah, we're kind of prepared for that this time around. Gonna be honest. 
No, I remember. How are you doing? Later, dragon. Ooh, we got earth plate though. That's nice. Earth plate is ground, I think. If it's ground, we can give it to you. Yeah, it is. There you go. You really want me to hoard spam? Let me go into the next area. Let's see what the next Pokemon is before we decide it. We know where he is. We can come back and hoard spam. We've only got the one honey also, so I need to go get some more honey. What did you forget, Kevin? I saw you said, what is, what's that code again? Are you talking about exclamation point BB? cave right there that's what we're looking for gyro ball so what is a nuzlocke if you go into the description of the video you can see that there is a self-contained amount of rules to a nuzlocke I could probably actually read them to you if i can get to it or someone would be kind enough to type it in. Um, so the self-contained rules for this Nuzlocke is um, you can only capture the first Pokemon in each route or cave or area that you encounter. So if I go to Route 1, I can only capture the first Pokemon I encounter. If I fail to catch it, that's it for the route. Um, when a Pokemon faints, it dies. All right. Um, yeah. Ah, Arky followed me over on... Uh, the Twitches. I still haven't updated all my Twitch ones. I gotta go. I gotta go back into. And she said, "Oh my God, look at that! What is that?" Oh yeah, Pokemon have to be named. That's right. So much Garbodors. I mean, we've already found Garbodor in another route. The fact that we found him here, too. Finish him off. Nigel's 32. Oh yeah, five dollars you can don't if you donate five dollars you can um revive a Pokemon. Oh <gasps> flame burst! Yes, please! We can get rid of Ember finally. No worries, Ark. I wonder what this spot's for. I can, Ark, if you want me to. We're about ready to hit the next town anyways. We just went to the basement so I could get Gyro Ball. Oh my god, it's a Raichu! Stronger, the Fire Fang or the... Uh, oof. 
crit hit. Also forgot static being a thing. I miss the back in the days when Charmander or Charmeleon would learn Flamethrower just like right off the bat. Ooh, superpower! Can I get rid of Explosion now, please? <laughs> Can I buy an Explosion, please? Oh, thank God I can get rid of Explosion for superpower. Yes? No. Which one is it? Get rid of Stomp. Okay. Uh... My hand, there was something over here, though, if I remember right. There was a slide down this way. He really wants me to keep explosion on him. Yeah, it does, but Ark, because Ark got to name him, Ark wants to keep explosion on him, so I'm like, okay. Oh no. That's right, I forgot. You are actually really hurting right now. Yeah, he will die instantly. <laughs> Ark, put me in, coach. I know a move that'll end it all. Ah, uh, dark. Heal. Yes, yes, it would count as a dead Pokemon, because he fainted. You would be very much right, Caden. Oh, that's another horde. Deoxys is excreting pressure! Ah, oh, those damn hordes. Only Deoxys wasn't just level 11. I could get, probably get some decent EXP off of him. Oh, another horde. Alright, let's see what upstairs horde is. Oh! Septile, that's kind of cool. All I can think about is an entire horde of... Here we are, guys. We made it to the next town. Welcome to the Pokemon Center. Oh, there's an O power. Cool. Mr. Bonding, what O power? Nothing but shinies. Dude, at that point, I'd call hacks. Which O power will we get? Which O power is gonna be? Oh, crit power. Critical power increases critical hits. All that crit.
Ooh, Evolite. Evolite is such a good item. You know who we're gonna put Evolite on? Yeah, I'm gonna go grab fish here in a second. Right here, mysterious um, evolutionary lump. When it's held by a Pokemon that can still evolve, raises its defense. Let's go ahead and give this to somebody. No, I didn't want to give you the Ted, Nigel. We want to give it to Cam, because Cam's not going to evolve to level 60. So, he's going to be stuck like that for a while. Hang on, let me go ahead and sort this out so I can just see what else I got. I've got... Caden, I've got, um... I've got them in a box called Dead. I didn't release them. Basically, when they die, they either need to be released or put in a box that's labeled dead. So I put them in a box that's labeled dead. That would be Ark. Ark revived you. Do, 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 do. Yes, you are a necromancer. Don't mess with the Dark Mage. Ooh, Sooth Bell. No, I need Shell Bell. That's the thing that's... Shell Bell is the thing. Ah, uh, multiplayer games, Caden. So, Smash on the weekends, Splatoon on the weekends. How are you rating your Pokemon with Love and Care? Yes. Which Pokemon will I show you? Zack is probably the one the longest in my team right now. Neat. But yeah, so... Use a flying or... Ooh, Stardust. Nice. Alright. We need to find... Oh, there we go. Hey, Master Brew! How's your journey going? Hello, Brew. Let's compare our coastal Pokedex and see who's seen more kinds of Pokemon. To put it another way, I'm challenging you to my own kind of Pokemon battle. So you've seen 45 kinds, huh? I lost. How frustrating. <laughs> Get this. I found some great Pokemon dancers. Oh, yes. I just remembered. The professor told us to say hello to the Mega Evolution Guru when we reached Salor City. That's right. He did say that. <laughs> you hate them calling you Master Brew? <laughs> um, hello. We were supposed to say hello again. A person called the Mega Evolution Guru. Oh, that's right, he did say that. Well, I guess we should look for the Mega Evolution Guru then. Where do you think he is anyways? I heard that he's in an imposing building deep within the city, the Tower of Mastery. Let's see here, big um, opposing building. I mean, sometimes when they say it, I'm just like, yes, I am Master Brew. Namaste.
Okay, that's the Pokemon Gym, which means it's this way. Master Brute, check this out! A new dance. Isn't this stone cool? I got it from a person called the Wandering Stone Collector showing off my dance moves. It might be a Mega Stone. Here, Master Brute, you can have it. I want you to have it, because you're such a great trainer and all. I still remember our battle on Route 5. We got the intriguing stone. So that's the Tower of Mastery. So cool! Well, I'll go call Trevis then. Go on ahead, okay? I gotta admit, that looks actually really nice. Like, I just want to point this out, though. Could you imagine making this in Minecraft? I must be, because I am the master. The Tower of Mastery! Only those who have been approved may climb the Tower of Mastery. Oh. I guess we haven't been approved yet. Oh, you must be Brew then. Sycamore told me you were coming. I am called the Mega Evolution Guru. It's a very long title. I guess you could say I'm an acquaintance of his, but Mega Evolution Guru isn't my real name, of course. Now, come here for a moment, will you? Oh. Hmm, only one of you. I thought he gave five kids per Pokedex. Isn't there anyone else with you? Insert my posse. Who are you talking to, Master Brew? People are oh god, we're not we're not going through this again. I'm not I'm not saying Mega Evolution Guru every time he says that. Pleased to meet you, Sycamore's pupils. But there is still only three of you, huh? Um. So when you come up with a role. You go into settings, and it's when you're putting in roles. Um, you can you can select which people have access to what, and then you can click on the channel itself, and then restrict access to only people with that role. It's really easy, Ark. I can I can show you later if you want. Anyways, what's this now? Were you the one who found that intriguing stone? Nah, it was given to me. What? Uh, it was you who found it, right, Master Brew? You just gave me the stone, dude. Come on, don't don't make me have to be a liar. Well, who found it doesn't really matter. What's important is that you were honest. If you told lies, the truth is clouded and eventually lost. And while we're being honest, that intriguing stone is just an ordinary rock. Hmm. Sure a lot of hubbub out there. Does that mean everyone has arrived? No worries. Lucario is in its Pokeball, but it's really happy to see you. We should go see what's going on too. Look like everybody's finally here. Master Brew! Where have you been? It feels like it's been some time since our whole group gathered in one place. Yeah, I think it hasn't been since Route 7. Meh, I'm not saying his name every time. I've been wondering this whole time, Mr. Guru. Who is that over there? That is my granddaughter. Coria. Cor... Corina. Corina. Her name's Corina. I don't know why I overcomplicated that. She's Corina. She's the Solor City Gym Leader. 
So sick of those people, now that you're all here, I suppose I should explain Mega Evolution. I assume you know all about Pokemon Evolution. I know, I know. Um, you have your Pokemon battle a lot, and then they grow even stronger and evolve. And then there are Pokemon that'll evolve with certain items. And some Pokemon evolve through friendship, and others will only evolve in certain places. Exactly. It's likely that Pokemon evolve in all, um, evolve in a lot of other ways as well. But Mega Evolution is an evolution that transcends other evolutions. Indeed. The Mega Evolution is a transformation of Pokemon that were thought to be unable to evolve even further. It's a whole new level of power. So, in an evolutionary line like Charmander, Charmeleon, and Charizard, does that mean Charizard would be able to evolve even further? Yes, exactly right. But not all Pokemon have a Mega Evolution. There is a reason why I used the word transformation a moment ago. Mega Evolution differs from evolution because it ends after a certain amount of time. In other words, it's a temporary evolution. What? It evolves, but then it goes back to what it was before? Yes, Mega Evolu- Oh, no, that's her. Yes, Mega Evolution is a special kind of evolution. It is said- It is- That said, we still know very little about it. What we know now is that it requires a special item. It is the most important element. This is the trust between a Pokemon and trainer. Trust, in other words, is the bond between a trainer and Pokemon? To make Mega Evolution work, you need two items. The Mega Stone for the Pokemon and a Mega Ring, which has a mysterious stone set in it for the trainer. Since Professor Sycamore entrusted each of you with one Pokedex, I would like to give these items to all of you. I'd like to share them with you, but... But... But, but, but... But what? Just come out and say it already. Sorry. But presently, I only have one Mega Ring. It is a very precious item. That is why my research isn't going anywhere. So, I want all of you to decide amongst yourselves which one of you will be the one who will... Who challenges... Uh, which one of you will be the one who challenges the Mega Evolution successor? I'll pass. Battling really isn't my scene. Mega Evolutions would be a way out of my league. Me too. It would be really cool memory... And it does look interesting, but... And I want to complete the Pokedex first. If you try to do too much at once, you won't be able to accomplish anything. So that just leaves Master Brew in Serena. Ah, oh, battle time. Trainers don't get much better than the two of you. Brew, let's battle for it. Whatever the reason, a battle gives us an opportunity to compete and see who Vanilla Town's best trainer really is. And I want to see... Yes, it does. Cool. I'm going to grab that for the thumbnail. Hang on. I wanna... Sorry, hang on one more time. I missed that. I wanted the statue of the Mega Lucario for the thumbnail, because I'm going to change the thumbnail after this. Alright, here we go, guys. Who thinks our team is ready? Between Sir Nigel, Jody, Thordak, Cam, Zach Quack, and Lycanroc. Let's see if we got the power. Are you ready? I will master Mega Evolution and set myself apart from other trainers. I'll also do it for my Pokemon. We've come so far together, and they never stop believing in me. They're trainer. You and your Pokemon are stronger, I can tell just by looking at you. But I will not lose. No, I'm going to win. I will not lose. No, I'm... So wait. I'm... Okay. I think we're all gonna die if it comes down to it. Just use an explosion. That harshly lowers my defense.
You want some of this? You want some of this? You're taunt me nothing to me, Persian. Ooh, Angel Bird. Nice. I'm kind of hoping Sir Nigel can just absolutely rock sauce here. Because we'll be able to mega evolve him if he can evolve into Charizard. Ah, Wailrin. Damn it. Alright. Go, go, Jody. Use the power. Oh, wait. Wailrin. Right. Hopefully I'm faster. It's Walrin, not Whalerin. Yeah. I I came I came to see the error of my ways. Yeah, it's a good thing that ice ball wasn't a cr crit hit. You got clickbaited. Ooh, that's a hefty chunk for Jody, though. Zach grew to level 33. Zach wants to learn takedown. Um. Yeah, no, Zach. We don't need you having a move that can damage yourself. Self-damaging moves just, just hurt. <laughs> nah, it's a level 30 P-Dove. So cute! It has roost though. This could end up going for a while, guys. Hang on, we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see if he can heal as fast as I can deal damage to it. Nope, it's done. It died with fire. Nigel's level 33. I mean, if it was a Bulbasaur or a Squirtle at this point, it would just be about ready to evolve. Three more levels. It was so strong. I could feel how powerful the bond between you and your partners is. <laughs> Losing is frustrating, but... You'll definitely be able to mega evolve your Pokemon, I'm sure of it. There may be winners and losers in Pokemon Battle, but I really thought you two and your Pokemon were all winners. Mega Evolution is nothing more than just one way to make your Pokemon stronger. There are many trainers who bring out the strength of their Pokemon without Mega Evolution. Wait, I have two streams open? What's going on? I only see the one. So I don't know what you were trying to say. Yeah, I only saw the one. Just because I had to search out my channel real quick. There we go. Well then, Brew. First, you should challenge. Which one does it say that on, Lo? Because I looked to see what it said was live. Let me get. Let me get through this. Hang on. 
First, you should challenge Karina, the gym leader. Pokemon need a Mega Stone, and a Pokemon trainer needs a Mega Ring. Well, my mysterious trainer, my Lucario, may have taken a shine to you, but now I must test to see if you're ready to challenge the Mega Evolution successor. I'll be waiting for you at the gym. Oh, the rest of you, the rest of your friends should come challenge the gym too. I'll bet the professor will be happy if you master Mega Evolution. That's one way you can show mastery as a trainer. Well, what did the professor want us to do after all? He said that we should aim to be the very best trainers we can and enjoy our journey. Right, I'm just kind of scooping through this. I actually see the one you're talking about. It said that this was an over an hour ago and it's waiting. I think that's a glitch on YouTube spot. Because I can tell you if I go to the thing. Yeah, we could do the gym quick. But still, having someone to compete against and aim for greater heights is a very fine thing. Master Brew, I think that you and Serena are going to compete against each other and get really strong. I'm so glad we're all traveling together. I'm gonna check real quick. So if I check the thing and it says there's something there, I'm gonna get rid of it real quick. Live streams. Yeah, it's a glitch on YouTube's end. That you see that it's literally just a glitch. All right, guys, time to see if Sir Nigel can evolve after a bunch of gym battles. Nothing like rollerblading through sand. I'm gonna deal with that um, at the end of the stream. Low, thanks for sending me the link. Might be able to exit out of that thing. All right, let's go ahead and grab us some heal items. Let's get 11 more of you. And let's get six more view. Wow, we actually finally have some cash flow. Took us long enough. Let's see here. What is second mark? Ooh, yeah! Finally! Ground type move, dig. Please. Poison type move, jab. Thank you. get rid of for dig 
damn, I was hoping that... I'll be honest, I was hoping that, um... Jody could learn it. Alright. Shalor City Gym. Oh, I gotta skate here. Cuz it's a roller derby, guys! That's why we're all on skates. Get over here. I wanted to fight you. Hey, you've got some impressive skating skills in order to have caught up to me. You won't show me up in battle, though. You are challenged by Rotor Skater, Sean. Or Sean. Sean or Sean? Sean, Sean the non believer. Shun him. Shun him and his toe to dial. Fang was not expecting you to have that. That's fine. We'll fully heal ourselves. Thank you for your patronage. Meditite. Meditite psychic fighting. Nigel, you're going out. No, the problem is Cam's a dark dragon, which means he'd still take super effective damage. I will use explosion for you, Ark, yes. If that's if if that would make you happy. He read my mind. Wow, Flame Burst, supercharged. Golem? Oh, crap. Seed the Golem, then use Mega Drain, because this sucker gonna have explosions. Always, it's because of the sturdy that really makes that explosion just absolutely stick and hard. There we go. Ah, thanks for the Cresselia cone. For the second Cresselia cone. I still don't know what part of the randomizer causes that. But I'm not gonna complain because just the throwaway heal item is kind of nice to get every now and then. Cresselia cones act as a full heal. 
not a full heal. Uh, yeah, full heal. It does. It's the thing that takes away all status moves. It doesn't always happen either. That's the thing. I never understood that. All right, Ark. This skate and battle terrain doesn't stop for anyone. Non-stop, full speed ahead. Go, go, go! Challenged by roller skater Rolanda. 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 Oh, roll. Rolanda. It's like Wombo. Wombo, Wombo, he, she, me, Wombo. Rolanda. That's, that's the new Wombo. Rolanda. Rolanda. Like, there's such a pun there. I'm sorry you're getting some lag there, Zach. I'm seeing no frame drops on my end or YouTube's end. Stream status is good and no frame drops. I want Nigel to get to Charizard. Ow. Self-inflicted. Oh, that hit like a dump truck. No, 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 that payback doesn't do much unless um, I hit him. I know. I know exactly what it says, fish. Don't you worry. He's a muffin. He wants to die. His existence is pain. If he survives too long, he'll get moldy and die that way. He wants to be eaten. It's his purpose. Could you imagine how messed up that would be, by the way, if food could talk to you? Just be like, eat me! Eat me. I'm delicious. He wants to be in my belly. Just who do you think you are stopping me while I'm skating? Challenge by roller skate, Kate. Skate, Kate. Had a feeling. Helioisk. That's right. You were a Pokemon in this generation. Oof. 
fish. No. Jody wants to learn Solar Beam? I think Petal Dance is just as powerful as Solar Beam. Punkaboo. That seems like a good setup. Oh no, I'm not saying that, but Petal Dance is just as powerful as Solar Beam, so there's no real need to run Solar Beam. Especially because Solar Beam needs two turns set up, and then Petal Dance doesn't. Ouch. I saw that flip. I swear there was another trainer over here too, yeah. Get over oh wait, no, you're Kate. I already got you. Looks like you could use some lessons. Don't worry, when it comes to speed skating and Pokemon battles, you won't find a better teacher. Challenged by Rotor Skater Dash! Ah, uh, Swampert. To be fair, guys, it is also April. I should probably give you guys your brew bucks for April. Because you guys are sponsors. Hang on, let me check. I'm gonna do the Giga Drain here and I'll pull up. I just need to double check to see what the amount was. Yeah, Zach's on Patreon. He's a sponsor. <gasps> Zach, you finally want to learn close combat! It's the happiest day ever. It's the reason why you're so good. You're flying with close combat. <laughs> ah! Don't fail. Ow. There's some explosions there. Dealing damage to Nigel. Nigel's down to 268. He's about to lose. Um. Let me go ahead and add those brew bucks to your account real quick. Domestic. Thank you, Victini, for the 666 donation. Guys, make sure to hashtag Victini too, by the way. Switch out. Victini. Let's go ahead and domestic.
I'm gonna go domestic. Ain't she fancy? Time for Lady Corina! It's big appearance. Um, my Greninja. I'd love to bring him back. Haha, <laughs> just messing around with you, I know. You're rolling in. You're rolling in the aisles? I. I know you're a strong trainer, so let's get to this show on the road. All right, let's do this. Do do. Reversing Karina. Challenged by gym leader Karina. Sends out Sunkern. That beautiful, beautiful fighting Lucario there, right, guys? Your sturdy can't do anything against my leech. Let's do this. And Giga Drain. Seriously, is it just me or is Jody like super overpowered for a sun for a sunflora? <gasps> Sir Nigel's level 35, guys! One more level. I don't think I've got a rare candy. Grassy Train does. Oh, it heals. Will Sir Nigel have a flawless victory? Ah, oh, you healed him. I'm sorry, Domestic. It's a 50-50 shoot. times are they going to heal? Like, wish, heal, terrain, heal, wish, heal, terrain, heal. Oh, finally.
Let's see, that literally went on way too long. For only 400 EXP, that went on way too long. I've been defeated! Alack! Allay! Lady Corina gave a terrible display. This is it. I give up my title and admit that your strength far exceeds. Just teasing. But here's your badge. Boy, you be rolling them soon. Boy, you be rolling in badges. That's what she's telling us, guys. Time to add that badge to our badges. Because we just got the Rumble Badge. See, last chat. Hang on. Solid Snake can come back. You got it, Victini. Rumble Badge. Boom. You got a rumble badge, then you can trade po- wait. If you got a roll badge, then you can trade Pokemon up to level 50 with your friends and they will be ready to roll. They love you alright, and you'll be able to roll over waves using a HM serve even outside of battles, and here why don't you take this TM? You've already been on a roll with it myself. Ooh, power up punch. That's a good fighting type move. Power up punch does just what it says on the box. The more you use it, the tougher your fists get. Keep at, keep using it, and your attack will go through the roof. Look, I do have to apologize. You'll have to make it up to the top of the Tower of Mastery if you want to get that Mega Ring. I'm sorry for sending you this way. And that, I swear, I'm not giving you the runaround. You've just done great just rolling with the punches. So, so great that I'd like to ask you a favor. Battle me again, won't you? This time, it won't just be as a gym battle. It'll be between two equals. As two trainers who can use Mega Evolution, I'll be waiting for you with Lucario at top of... Okay. Commands? Why are you commanding? I'm confused. Let's move over. Well, Solid's been revived due to that 666 donation, which puts our kill count down to four. I'm checking, I'm checking. Nope, no rare candies. No such luck, Mr. Nigel. No such luck. But on the plus side, Nigel, look at this. Look at how close you are. Only 2,500 experience to go. We can do this. By the end of this area, you'll be able to Mega Evolve. Oh, Karina. Oh, Karina, I mean, the Mega Evolution successor is waiting for you at the top of the tower. Only those who have been approved can climb the Tower Mastery. Oh, you're, you may pass.
what was the point of that room besides just some backstory? Okay. sweet though no need for the rooms but we just got low sweep I think they just want to be able to see it Nigel because they have to go soon that's all it is we're here we're here I really love this place. When I'm here with my Pokemon, looking at the wide open sky above, all my worries just disappear and I feel like I can do anything. Thanks for coming all the way here. It was decided that this must be the place where the Mega Ring is handed over. Something about making sure we never forget to set our sights as high as the sky. And here it is. Your very own Mega Ring. It is the shape of a bracelet, so it's super easy to wear. Brew equipped the Mega Ring on his left wrist. Give your Pokemon the right Mega Stone and try battling with it. Your Pokemon will surely answer the call of the Mega Ring. Hmm? Lucario, what's wrong? Lucario, are you sure? You want to battle alongside that trainer? I don't know what to say. I'm a bit shocked that some traveling trainer seems to have a stronger bond with you than I do. Ha. Huh. Well, he must be something special. What do you say, trainer? Will you and Lucario battle against me? A Lucario on Lucario battle. It'll be nothing short of riveting. Both have Lucario White in hand, so how about it? Want to get the show on the road? I feel Lucario's passion. Perhaps it's just it doesn't want to lose to another Lucario, but it may be that it's just on the same wavelength as you. Here goes. Ready, Lucario? Let's give it our all! You're challenged by successor Karina. Uses Pinsir. That's some Lucario. Oh wow, my Lucario's a Tyranitar. Mmm. Tyranitar. <gasps> With the Mega Stone. The Tyranitarite is reacting. Tyranitar has mega evolved. Tyranitar held on. What incredible bond you have. I know, right? What an explosive battle. I could tell both your mega Tyranitar didn't hold anything back. With strong bongs like that, you shouldn't have any trouble triggering your Pokemon's Mega Evolution. I think it would be best if you took that Lucario along with you on your journey. It's quite apparent that you two make an incredible team. I'm 
just going to switch out for Lycanroc for the moment. I received Tyranitar! Alright guys, who wants to be Tyranitar? Grimlock. Let's see here. Just doesn't have a Pokemon yet. So we can do that. And then Lo, since you're the only one who still doesn't have a Pokemon, since your Pokemon died, you get the next one in the route then. How about that? Alright, Jess, what do you want it named? Not a panda, but I can. I don't think, and I don't think I can fit all that on there. But I can name Kung. Fu, I can name her Kung Fu. If you're good with that, I'm gonna go ahead and hit enter. <laughs> it's not a panda. Alright. Kung Fu it is. As long as Pokemon and trainers have kindness and care for each other and give each other courage, the world will be full of smiles. I was hoping we could get kind of like a view here, but I guess not. Alright, let's get... Let's get Lycan back in here. Nigel's about to evolve and we have his Mega Stone as well. Well, we've got two Mega Evolutions available to us now, basically. Later, Jess. Bashful, Tyrant, Tyrite, Chip Away, Rock Slide, Scary Face, Thrash. Yeah, we're gonna need some better moves for them. Um, I missed an item. What did I miss, Victini? I'm gonna move you over there. Next good one's gonna be Plant, so we might want you up there. So we're gonna put Lux in the team. I will go back for that. He's grass ground. Sarah. 
Stardust. Oh. Max either. I didn't even see that there. <laughs> Hi, neighbor, you should use this. Ah, oh, we got Surf! Sage, how's it going? If you use the HM Surf, you can travel over water. When you think about it, it's kind of amazing that a person like you came to Kalos and ended up traveling with me. It's like destiny in a way. I don't think any of our Pokemon can know Surf, so we're probably gonna have to go grab our water type. It's a good thing that... Yeah, I don't think any of them can. Nope. Let's go grab our water type. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm thinking. It's a good thing. I think Gudra can learn Surf, maybe. You know what? Actually, maybe not. At the very least, Lord Helix would have been able to. I will. Let's get rid of Pound, keep Quick Attack. Wow, six Stardusts? I didn't realize we had already collected that much of them. <laughs> I mean, that's okay, Sage. We're about to hit open waters. It's a good thing that... We're doing pretty good here. Let's go ahead, I gotta switch Cam out too. Cam is now solid. Snake. That is water. Just one sec. Yeah, we're getting pretty close there. I think if I looked this morning, we were 26 away. All right, guys, here comes the question. Do we go for the grass or do we go for the water catch? Ooh, wait here, hang on. 
Well, guys, we can get a Pokemon, too. We're getting two Pokemon here. We get we get whatever Lapras ends up being, and then we get a... Uh... Yeah. Everybody wants to see what's in the water. Because, I mean, what's in the water will be different than what's on land. We're just going to go ahead and do this just so we can grab whatever the Lapras is going to be. Well, here's the thing, Kevin. It's randomized, so it doesn't matter. It just depends on where you want it to see it caught. Let's take it. Ah, oh, it's a Pyroar. Who wants to be Pyroar? All right. Low grid two. The low gridning. If we lose Sir Nigel, you're definitely going to come in handy. Alright, Sage. Yeah, you're at... Oh, Noble Roar, Take Down, Firefang, and Endeavor. Dude, you have Gyaradosite on you! You really wanted a Mega Evolve. I think I think if we get a Magikarp, we need to name it Logarid 3. Just because you had the Gyaradosite on you. All right, you guys said you wanted to check the water. So, mind you, it's not necessarily going to have water Pokemon. Gothic Hotel. I told you guys it w wouldn't necessarily be a uh, a water Pokemon that we'd see in the water. I tried to make that clear. I mean, if you want to be Gothic Attell, that's fine. Huh? 
You just gotta catch her. Gothcatel has been added to the Pokedex. Gothcatel, the astral body Pokemon. Starry skies, thousands of light years away, are visible in the space distorted by their intense psychic power. Kevin, what do we name it? As we wait. Sigma Stretch! At this rate, I'm just gonna name it, um, Kevin. Her name will be Kevin. She will be the most beautiful Kevin. Kevin Cattell? I knew it could be that. Kevin Tell. Kevin Cattell. Should put an extra key in there. Hey, what was that? It's a ranch, you say. Oh, this is the Go Go Ranch. Shiny stone. Interesting, interesting. Either way, we have to go over here. See last chat. Yeah, this is all the same route still, um, Victini. The route hasn't changed yet. This is still other encounters in the area. Or you talk about encounters on the water. I always thought it was weird that Withdrawal ends up being a Water-type move. I almost feel like it should have been classified as just a normal type. <gasps> Leftovers!
You're about to find out just how strong my family is. I could put leftovers on Greninja. Usually I run either Life Orb or Leftovers, so Leftovers wouldn't be bad. Thing is, I need, uh, what is it? Um, Grass Knot, and I'm gonna need Ice Beam. Like, if I want Greninja to be good, he needs to have those. Okay. Okay, that was weird. I got a claw fossil. Gunk shot isn't until um Ruby and Sapphire. Yeah, that's what I just thought. gonna scare me right right when not when I'm on a phone call guys come on I'm not on mute anymore I'm still there now I just gonna evolve here guys I appreciate small Nigel grew to level 36. Here it is, guys. gives you wings! Find a cool picture of a Charizard for you.
finally gives me an excuse to get rid of this. I think I might have not have picked a good image. Yeah, that's not a good image. I need a better image. I mean, Nigel can be pregnant if he wants to be. Gerdosite, where is it? Charizard. There it is. You know what, I actually, I actually wanted to check this. I was right. The Pokedex is useless in, in this. It'd be cool if it was. Duh, superior! Kevin, I'm, I don't do Pokemon battles with X and Y because I can't. But because of the randomizer, I can't go online at all. It's now the most powerful Pokemon on our team. I'm gonna switch you with Lycanroc. You just want that explosion to happen. I can already see it in your face. I can see it in your, uh... Yeah, I 
can see it. Just you're just like yes, let it happen. Let the explosion happen. Maybe I can actually use that one over here as long as Charizard's not in the front. It should still be okay. There we go. Oh, I forgot to turn on his second typing. Oops, my bad. Explosion, the only magic worth using. Have you been talking to Mega Me too much, Ark? I think you've been talking to Mega Me just a smidge too much. Everything comes from the ocean, everything returns to the ocean.
Alright, I'm back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just some stuff with my parents had to take care of. I'm sure everybody understands that. Sometimes you got stuff you got to take care of. He's psychic rock, isn't he? This is where I use explosion, right arc? Right arc? Explosions? <laughs> I was making a joke. It was more of a joke than anything, don't worry. Shop is forty. That's eighty. Hey, when does Givite evolve, anyways? Out of curiosity. You know what? We could probably also drop him now. Once everybody's up to level, we could probably drop him. Because I think he's just a dig. Because, I mean, ground is handled by Lux now. And I could probably throw Cam back in then. 48. Okay. Ooh, it's a Buffalant. Oh no. You're the beefy Pokemon, aren't you? Revenge is a fighting type move. I. You guys and your explosions. Oh wait, they can jump over here, that's right. Forgot about that. I 
Oh, we already fought him. I'd like to bury my face in the fur around a Tauros' neck with his big whiff of its own. That's kind of gross. He likes to smell cow pie. I think Lux can handle this. I think. Five. Ah, shuckle. My ability was suppressed. Come on. God damn it, I forgot how freaking strong Shuckle is. Shuckle's got the most defense, doesn't he? I forget, what is Resto Chesto Shuckle? It's. It's got the berry, it's got recycle, it's got rest. I forget what the other moves on Resto Chesto. Brew, I challenge you to a battle in front of the gym. Prepare yourself. Oh, God. Silk Scarf. Feel that would have been nice a while ago. You'd usually Gliscar. It's, oh, it's such a weird one. I gotta think that one over. I almost want to say, why not just put um, Black Sludge on him? 
But, um... Razor Fang might be the better choice. Hi, I'm the game director. I think this is the only game where the game director doesn't have a building of his own. He's just in a hotel. I mean, that game looks really good. I hope you're enjoying it. Black Sludge works the same as Leftovers on Poison Types. That's why. You ready to try to take the quiz? Yeah! Alright, now here's the question. What move am I describing? The user is holding an item. This attack inflicts massive damage. It's not ac- It's Acrobat. God, it's not these people. Why, hello, Brew! Congratulations! I see you finally obtained everything you needed for Mega Evolution. A Mega Stone for your Pokémon, a Mega Ring for your trainer, and a strong bond between you and your Pokémon. A strong bond? It's only a hypothesis, but I think the bond between Pokémon and trainer is key to this new evolution. But what is this bond exactly, and why... Are there examples of Mega Evolution only in the Kalos region? There's still so much we don't know. Does this mean, or does this make you think of something like the Kalos legendary Pokemon? Only found here in the Kalos region, right? Nowhere else? Maybe it's not a coincidence. Oh, what an excellent point indeed. The more you know, the more there is to research. The excitement never ends, does it? Oh, right. I came to give you this. Oh, thank god. Finally, we got Fly. Use HM Fly to pop over to the Pokemon Centers as you please to the areas which you visited. Bonds. Are they really that important to all of us, aren't they? When I'm acting, I think I'm always trying to forget about the bonds between myself and the character I'm playing. If all I think about is how I'm nothing like a character, then I'll just hate playing it. But if I focus on what I have in common with the character and put myself into her shoes, I might be able to understand her. It's the same for people or Pokemon. Oh, never mind me. I'm just blabbing about my own things. Let's have a battle next we meet, shall we? I'm looking forward to it. Finally got Fly. Wait, Gliscor isn't poison? Is it ground then? I always thought it was poison. Mm, 
and Toxic Orb, yeah. Post Storm, you have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Hidden abilities, you say? I mean, our, our Greninja has that hidden ability. things on mute. Yeah, I went to go check something and that popped up. <laughs> go figure, right, Ark? Doesn't Razor Claw also increase crit chance? I thought that's its default ability, not just its evolutionary ability. Kind of like how, um... What is it? The one that's used to evolve Onyx into Steelix. Ooh, Skyplate. Metal Coat, yeah. Metal Coat boosts Steel-type moves. Oh my god, Brew! Oh, sorry, I'm late! So, could you show me Mega Evolution? Of course, whether you use Mega Evolution in battle or not is entirely up to you, but I'd like to know what potential of Pokémon really is. I think you can buy a second one at the uh, battle area, whether it's Battle Tower or wherever, wherever you can use your BP, you can usually buy another one. Of course she has an Abra. Sand dial, you say? I think I can one-shot Nose Pass unless it has Sturdy. Of course it has Sturdy. Snake Root to level 26. As, Poke as a Pokemon trainer, I find you really interesting. Or irritating. Irritating, not interesting. Of course you wouldn't find us interesting. Serena. Depends on what you're trying to do. If you're trying to survive longer Toxic Orb, if you're trying to hit harder Razor Fang. 
Razor Fang doesn't evolve unless you trade with it, though, if I remember right. Well, good luck with your gym battle. Do your best, okay? I mean, she could have healed our Pokemon before she left. No worries, Zach. Oh, so you're saying that they've already have it. So you're saying you're wonder trading. Um, so one has Toxic Orb, one has Razor Fang. I mean, if you want the evolution, go for Razor Fang. If you're looking to battle, go with the Toxic Orb. was an easy fight. We actually might get our fourth gym badge today, guys. I'm sorry if I'm confusing you. That is not my intention at all. I promise you this. There's no trainer down there. Here to challenge the gym, are you? Let's see your Pokemon then. Might not be the best here. I wonder, would low sweep even work on a bird? You're trading a box of them, and I want them to hold one of them. Then trade the Toxic Orb. Toxic Orb you can get multiples of very easily through the battle through battle stuff in game. So trade trade off the Toxic Orb if you're looking to trade it off. Go with the Toxic. People can use Toxic Orb. Ah, Joltik. Wait, do I not have any ground type moves on you? Whoops. Really need to put Dig on you.
Lux Creed to level 26. And Rosary is the final one. So not just have this one. Mega Ball, why did it undo it? Oh well. Mm. Just about done. We're gonna finish off this gym. How are you doing? Ah, oh, you're cold. It's cold outside. Yeah. It's cold outside. Come here. Come here. Hi. From Challenge by Pokemon Ranger Brook. <laughs> uh, cold hands, cold hands, cold hands, cold hands, cold hands. No, Victini, no worries, buddy. No worries at all, my friend. I'm sorry if I was being confusing. Solid Snake Rita level 27. Nice. Gotharita. Alright. Almost got Pokemon up to level 40 now. Yeah, our, she just she left us a second ago. She went to go get changed out of her work scrubs. To realize our true potential, my Pokémon and I must become connected on an emotional level. The emotion has to be there, guys. Ooh, Kabutops. Love me some Kabutops. Sounds like she's really into Pokémon, doesn't it? Pokey Al Ality. 
I, I see what you did there. I see what you did there. Enduring to one HP, really? So it has Leer, Endure, Sand Attack. Do you have any actual attacking moves, Kabutops? I guess the world will never know. Yeah, does Torterra learn Giga Drain? It does learn Giga Drain. I didn't want to swap anything out yet. It learns Giga Drain um, at I can always go back and teach it again. I know I really shouldn't keep Curse. I really shouldn't. Carnivine switch. I thought Carnivine was such a weird Pokemon. Because it looks like it just floats in the air like that. Looks like you and your Pokemon are even more in tune with one another than my team is. Thanks for the life orb? I think that, like I said, I think there's something wrong with the with the randomizer. It randomized the items that the trainers gave out. <laughs> Get a quick save. Time for Old Man Magoo. Hey, Old Man Magoo. Wait, Giga Drain's also a item, isn't it? Is it not? I don't know. Solar Beam, Energy Ball, Grass Knot. Nope. Guess not. Ho ho! So you've made it to clear up here? I'm the Gym Leader. Ramos is the name. So, what do you think, Whippersnapper? Do you enjoy the garden playground I made with all these sturdy plants of mine? Their strength is a sign of me strength. As a gardener and as a gym leader. Yeah! Sure ye up for a face and all that? Ramos. We are challenged by leader Ramos. He has a D-Watt. D-Watt. D-Watt, D-Watt. Should have probably healed before going into this.
Ooh, Lichen Rock. There you go. Steelix is steel ground, not steel rock, if I remember right. Nido King is the last one. Brown Poison. Welcome back, Jess. There we go. So Nigel grew to level 39. Nice. Zach to level 38. Ah. You can take things too quickly when you come to form in a friendship with your Pokemon, Sprout. I believe in ye po- uh, Ye believed in ye Pokemon, and they believed in ye too. Mighty oaks from acorns grow. Go on then, you've earned it. Here's your own bad plant badge, Sprout. Let's go ahead and add that in. Two badges today. You got yourself a plant badge. If you can use the H, um, then you can use even the HM fly. Why not battle it real boon? Pokemon up to level 60 will listen to you. It's too easy as falling off a log. Even if you got them from a tree. Here, have this too. Might as well make ye, make hay while the sun shines, I reckon. Ooh, grass knot. Greninja just became plant type. Is grass not the heavier the Pokemon, the more it hurts. Hmm, grass not. Greninja just got a new ability, Salt Snake.
So, we have that claw fossil. Well, how do you guys feel about going and checking out what that thing is? Because for some reason we got a claw fossil. Back to Amberit Town. Spent a lot of time here the other night. I'm researching fossils. Yeah, let's restore something. What are we getting? Oh, it's a Finneon. I was hoping for something cool. Sure, Jess. Just give me a second. Guys, we're gonna be going on a raid here in a bit. We got two badges today. Got a bunch of new Pokemon. Our team's looking pretty solid, too. Got. We got Dummy Thick the Snorlax, Lord Helix the Omnimite, Arm Knight, Armaldo, Jody the Sunflora, Flarb the Gudra, Shredder the Sandshrew. We just got this Finneon. Ooh, it had a Tire Ball on it though. We got Kevin Tella, the uh, Gothic Attell. Kevin Tattel. Uh, we got Low Grid 2, the Pyroar. Kung Fu, the Tyranitar. And Cam. Victine, if you can hang on a second, we're about to go on a raid. So. Let's go ahead and pick out a raid target. We're going to go raid Tato. Let us go do that hashtag microbrew raid tonight. We are going to raid Epic Potato Chip. If you guys haven't already, please make sure to like, share, and subscribe to the Gamers Brew. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Discord, Instagram, and all those awesome social media pages in between. And until next time, guys, I am Brandon of the Gamers Brew. Thank you so much for watching. Let's go on that raid, and I'll see you guys all next time. Bye-bye. Kadabra. Dark Ghost Psychic seems to be good against each other. Yeah, seems that way. Like, all of them are a little interchangeable. Hey, what's up, Ark? Microbrew Raid. What's up, Raiders? Nah, I'll leave out, uh, Hooters. Hunter used Stab Own Eye. Super effective. Hello, Brew. How was the rest of your Nuzlocke? Hello, Jesse M. Thanks for coming in with our raid. We were also playing Pokemon. Oh, I forgot about that. Does curse is curse ongoing?
But thank you so much, guys. If you don't know Mr. Gamer's Brew, check him out. He cool. Oof, yes, that is ongoing. I'm glad you killed it. <laughs> We're about to get some more Pokemon next time. Oh, you just got your fourth badge. GG. Kadabra, oh my. I haven't given up on becoming the greatest trainer. I'm going to find out why I can't win and become stronger. When I do, I will challenge you, and I'll beat you down with all the-